Hey everyone, Kelly Dean Allen here again. Today I'm going to show you how to play Say What You Will, Fastway and Fast Eddie Clark. We are in standard tuning for this tutorial and this track is a killer opening riff. Goes a little something like this. <laughs> You're going to be repeating that eight times at the beginning of this track. So uh, this riff starts with two quick palm muted open A strings. And then you're going to go five, six, seven of the G, picking each note. Then you're going to drop off to the five, give it a quick pick, and then hammer on to six and pull it back off to five. Kind of like that, right? Then you're going to jump up here to the seven of the D, pull it off to the five of the D, and then drop on to the seven of the A. Right, and that little lick there is the core of this riff. Then you're going to take that 7 of the A that you just dropped on to roll down into a double stop on the 7s of the D and the G, hit that twice on the upstroke, and then drop off to a double stop on the 5s and get that on the upstroke. Now these uh, double stops on the 7s, you're going to catch it on the upstroke, but on the way back down you're going to hit a quick little mute in between the two uh, pick strikes, right? So up, down, up, with the second one being a mute. And then off to two aggressively struck A power chords, right? And that is the riff. And you're going to repeat that four more times uh, at the beginning of this track before dropping into the first verse. Now the first verse is pretty easy, it's just uh, we're coming off those two A power chords. Choke it off. Going to drop onto a double stop on the fives of the D and the G and then onto the sevens, right? And then go seven to five, and then five to seven, seven to five, and then back off to two more A power chords and repeat. for the chorus, right? And you're going to repeat that four more times during the chorus. And then drop right back into another verse, back into another chorus, and uh, and that's all the rhythm parts to this one. There's no bridge, there's no variations whatsoever. Except for the solo. The solo is going to change key into B. And uh, B minor pentatonic work here for the solo. Let's run through the solo first and then we'll dig into how to play it. <laughs> back into the riff again for the chorus. So, the solo. That's the first lick of the solo. Five on the seven of the low E. Grab the five of the A, drop on the seven, slide it into nine. Down to seven of the D. Right? And then we're going to do a pull off from nine off to seven, grabbing the nine of the uh, A, and you're going to repeat that four times. Kind of like that, right? And then you're going to drop, after you repeat that four times, onto a double stop here on the sevens of the G and the B string. Give it a little waggle, right? Into this. Just a classic blues licks, bending double stops, right? Like making lots of noise. That's the first lick, just bending this double stop here on the nines of the G and the B. Second one, you're going to release it off to the seven, grab the nine of the D, and back to the double stop on the sevens. Back up to that nine, back to the double stop, right? And then you're going to kind of repeat that. However, the second time, you're going to catch the uh, double stop here on the sevens of the B and the high E after the bend. And then finish it the same way, right? Kind of like that. And, uh, and then we're into this. 
So just classic blues lick here, bending this nine, grabbing this double stop on the sevens. Four times, right, grabbing that double stop on the uh, sevens on the upstroke. Into this lick. Pulling off ten off to seven. And then pulling off nine off to seven, grabbing the nine of the D. And you're going to repeat that twice. And then finish on the seven of the G, right? So that's that whole lick put together there. Finishing the first half of the solo with this. Just going right down the B minor pentatonic, starting on the nine of the G, little bend release. Just going right up the nines and sevens. When you get to the A string, you're gonna back it off to the five, and then seven, five, seven of the low E. Right, and that's the first half of the solo. Now the second half of the solo is all double stops on the B and the high E string sliding into them at the 10th fret four times. Into 12, back to 10, back to 9, back to 7. Repeat, 12, 10, 9, 7. Back into those two A power chords, drop back into the main riff again for the chorus. And that is the solo. So let's take it from the top and then we'll be done. right back into another chorus, then we're going to drop into another verse, another chorus, end of track. That, my friends, is how you play Say What You Will, Fast Eddie Clark, and Fast Way. Certainly hope you enjoyed that, found it helpful. If you did, please hit that like button right down there, maybe drop me a subscribe if you haven't done that already, as that would be very kind and helpful to the growth of my little channel. Hope you're well out there in your little guitar corner of the world, wherever that may find you, and we will see you next time. Cheers.